horsey people, we're back with Horse Reality and today I'm doing a video purely on Charlie and our future studs for you guys to keep an eye out for. Yeah, I know, it's awesome. So Charlie here was actually gifted to me by one of our, my subscribers. We're gonna do a video on reading the fan mail from Horse Reality as well. You guys have left me some really cool stuff, um, which I really, really appreciate. So Charlie has got 12 very good confirmation stats and he has had four day champions, 72 first premiums and two premiums. He's he's doing well. Actually, while we're thinking about that, let's just go to competitions because I always forget about this. Uh, we want to go to confirmation. Confirmation, that's what we want to do. And then let's go on to enter here and I just want to enter this lot, which is going to cost me a lot of money. So guys, yeah, I've actually dropped the stud fee on him. I want to like be able to, normally it does all of them, that's really annoying. Normally it's, um, it highlights all of these, but it's not doing that today, so it's going to make me click all of them. Fabulous. So I did drop the stud feet on Charlie, guys, because um, I'd rather you guys just used him and just got some cool foals out of him. I mean, it doesn't, and there's no limit is there to the stallions, so we might as well, might as well have a bit of fun there. So, um, yeah, I'm super chuffed with him, but guys, we do have some future stallions, which is going to be really cool. We'll look at some of the, that's my <laughs> quarter horse mares, we'll look at Charlie's foals in a minute. Um, he's he's bred some cool colours as well, because obviously if you look at him, and we look at his colouring in the genetic side here, so as you can see, he is winning quite a lot of the old uh, shows there. So, <laughs> that's my Australian accent. So he's, a Ron he's carrying, um, he is a, I think he's... What would this be? A chestnut, roan, champagne, splash white, roan thing. If anybody can like tidy that up, that'd be great. What colour is he? Do you guys know specifically what colour he would be? To me, he looks like a chestnut roan with a splash white. <laughs> I don't know. But anyway, he's beautiful and he's he has produced some really cool balls. Let's look at them now while we're here. So most recently has been my... the stuff I've bred from him. So we've had this one which I did sell. Did I sell? No? I'm being really stupid. This is actually one of your guys' uh, foals, I think. That's a beautiful foal. This mare is stunning. Oh my gosh. She's beautiful, guys. I love a roan. I'm a sucker for a roan. Um, you guys know I love my greys, but on this game in particular, I think the artwork's stunning. So, yeah, just Charlie's foals have been great. I will, yeah, let's just have a look. See, see which ones I've got. Oop, SS21, that's me. So, yeah, he's bred. Oh, he had this one. Yeah, he has bred some really cool colours, I must admit. Um, this one's been my favourite one, actually. This one, look how beautiful she is. I think her achievements are 12. Pretty sure she's 12. She's 11, very good. So he has been breeding some wicked foals. This one is definitely one of my favourites because she's got blue eyes as well. Let's go on to the stallion studs. So, so I just want to show you guys some of the future stallions that we're going to have through on Horse Reality and why I'm keeping them as well. I might sell a couple but this one guys I'm waiting for him to age up because he is not going anywhere um, I just want to show you his stats and stuff so he is a black let's just train him a bit actually so he's a black stallion <laughs> hence the name the black stallion so yeah I haven't actually done a color thing on him let's go to the laboratory lab not lavatory laboratory <laughs> oh Okay, let's see what we've got here. Hopefully, I mean, his family tree is quite cool. Let's perform tests. Let's see what we got here. So he's carrying a cream pearl and a splash white jean, and he's black, so that's cool. So he, yeah, he's got that sort of creamy colour. So if we bred him with mares that have got silver jeans and cremellos and stuff like that, I think you'd get some cool folds out of him. He's going to be wicked. So he's one to watch, guys. I'm going to just train him up. I'm not going to spend any more DP points because apparently we need DP points now to expand our stable block. Ugh, how annoying. So, <laughs> no, pain in the bum. Uh, this is another one we have at the moment as well. I kept, actually, somebody gave this one to me again, gifted him. I can't buy all the ones that you guys are gifting me. I'd love to, but we're running out of stables. <laughs> the reason I bought this one, though, he has got 11 very good, which I was really chuffed with. But it's his colour that I love. Look at it. He's got a double cream pearl, splash white. So he's going to be beautiful. He's got good genetic potential as well at 644. 
So we'll wait till he ages up and then he's going to produce some cool foals. Las Vegas is some is one that somebody gave me. This is actually a mare, so I don't know why we're over here. I love the little coloured horses though. I think they're really wicked, or the Tobianos. Heavenly Heights is one that somebody gave me as well. He's stunning. He hasn't got like the best... He has got very good, but he hasn't got full achievements, but he's beautiful. Look at his colouring. If you want to breed like palominos and stuff like that let's check out what his offspring looks like i've not bred from him actually yeah he's got this kind of split um silvery sort of thing on the go you can see where the color is sort of broken up a bit there so achievements he's he's won quite a lot of premiums and he's been a day champion as well yeah i've been really yeah so i really appreciate that one so thank you guys um subscriber who who did that let's can i enter him in competition so i think he's actually trained up a little bit more so let's both of these were from the same people i believe so thank you so much so generous generosity from you guys has just been absolutely over the like it's been been insane oreo i wanted to keep just because of his color i haven't bred a stallion this color before kind of reminds me of the one that we bred recently in the generation the insane to plain generation on rival stars kind of reminds me of that it's this sort of i don't know he so if we look at his genetics oh we haven't gone let's go to the lab tour again I need to put some money away in the bank today and I also need to train for our vet practice. That is something I need to do. Okay, right, let's do it. The form test. I'm sorry if my mic's off a bit, guys. I don't know what's happened. I think my computer just struggles in life and it's just like exploded and now it can't record my voice properly either anymore. So we might have to think about getting a new laptop. Ah! Money, money, money. Must be funny in a rich man's world. Don't know why we're looking at quarter horse society because I've clicked the wrong button. Okay, so I'm yeah, I'm super. Oh, we can level him up. Sweet. He's a really nice horse. I really like him. Um, let's have a look. Achievements. Yeah, so he's got ten very good. I was chuffed with him. I can't remember who his mum was actually. Ebony. Nice. Yeah, I was really happy with him. It's more his colouring. I mean, I don't know where it came from. It must be one of these or something. Yep, yeah, super duper chuff with him. I'm hoping we can breed that unique colour, but maybe take it up a notch so we get some 12 very good folds out of him. Aries is another one that um, I think I bred him. Did I breed him? Yes, from Moon. Because the reason I'm keeping him, again, is because of his colouring. He's got 10 very good. Um, his colouring's amazing. I mean, he's got he's a carrier of Dun, Splash White, and he's a double cream pulse. So, yeah, if you guys are looking for a stud that's probably going to breed this colour, then there he is. But we've got to wait for, for him to age up, because obviously he's still a baby. Still a little baba. Um, we've got Sooty. I'm a bit sporadic with this today, guys. I don't know who this... This is a new one that's just come off his mum. He's got blue eyes. I just want to check his achievements. Yeah, he's, he's really cool. Yes, he's just a bay. I love bays, but... Um, he's actually, yeah, he's one of Charlie's again as well. And Bonnie. Bonnie's one of my best mares. I do like her. Um, let's check his... So he's got... Yeah, he's doing really well, actually. Possibly might sell him, but I'm not sure. But he is carrying a champagne and a splash white gene as well. So he's really nice. And he's got blue eyes. He needs a name, actually, guys. So comment below some ideas for him. We'll be renaming our Icelandics from the last video as well. That some of you guys have suggested, which I need to write down. Let's... Why have I not looked after Charlie while we were there? Let's just look after Charlie a second. So, um, are you guys playing the game at the moment? And if you are, what breeds are you focusing on? Or are you just not bothering with focusing on breeds? Are you just having a hoop? So, I am i haven't been playing this too long, I suppose. I've been on and off it. I wish I was a bit more... What's the word? Um, I don't know why it keeps taking me to this quarter horse society thing. Um, I do want a black horse with a silver mane. That's on my list of things I want on this game. So... We've got Charlie, Heavenly Heights um, up at the moment. And actually for an Icelandic here, we've got this guy. Now the reason I didn't sell him, he hasn't got the best... Well, he has got good achievements for an Icelandic. But the reason I didn't sell him was because of his colouring. Now, if you look at him, he's like a... What is he? A black brown thing? I just loved his colour. So I was like, Do you know what? I'm going to keep him as a stallion and you guys can use him. He's got one average annoyingly, but actually his foals shouldn't be producing that. It should be fine if you've got a decent mare. He hasn't had any foals yet. Somebody did breed with him the other day, but we'll get there. We'll get there, won't we, Topaz? Bless him. He says, no ladies like me. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I'm mad, I know. 
Um, okie dokie, right moving on, let's get back. So let's show you some of Charlie's babies that we just, we just had. We're going to probably breed some more today as well. Check, let's check the estate a second. I've got 10 stables left and some of you guys actually have been leaving me. If we go to notifications, you've left me some private trades which I really love and I really appreciate. Thank you so much guys. Um, I'm not, oh this knob, knob stuff is lovely. I'm actually, oh so hard. I just, um, oh he's lovely as well. I don't think I'm going to buy any more. I just haven't got the room guys. This one's lovely. <laughs> I want this. Oh. A 14 very good um actually what you just commented on one of my videos actually oh what's your name subscriber who is awesome for giving me this horse thank you so much you're a legend i will buy this and it's a cool color that's going straight in my basket so we have a new icelandic coming to the herd Woohoo! the thing about the horse reality is when you breed a mare it won't yeah if you if you have a foal or whatever oh, what's my laptop doing now if you have a foal or whatever, um, it won't like know that. How do I explain this? Let's put this little foal that we bred here. You guys have come up with a cool name for her as well, actually. Um, yeah, some of you guys said about um, you know, because because we run out of stables. When you breed a mare, it doesn't it doesn't realise that you've run out of stables, so we end up having over the amount of horses. So I will actually be selling some of these horses eventually as well i loved this one's color this one i was really chuffed with the color on this one let's put her into icelandic horses is it icelandic or icelandic what what is that i don't know because i don't i don't always process stuff right so i just make things up so let's just check out some of his foals a second sorry guys there was a bit of a break in that because i just had to answer the door guys i just wanted to show you this new foal of golden princess Look how cool this foal's come out. <laughs> I was like, this is awesome. I can't, I think this is Charlie's again. No, it's not, it's Charlie's. Hang on, hold the phone. Let's click on the foal, I mean, that would be helpful. Yes, this is another one of Charlie's. Charlie does produce some really cool foals. <gasps> super duper. So I was super happy with this. I mean, um, I didn't check the, this foal literally just was bred yesterday. So um, let's check our achievements. Okay, that's pretty good considering the mum has actually only got, so what have we got here for the fall? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Very good. And, and the mum's got the mum was what I was supposed to click on. So let's just go back a second. The game's gonna freak out in a minute. It's gonna go. Can't cope. We're going backwards. Ooh. Oh, you guys can see I've been buying stuff on. Whoops, <laughs> that's bad. Whoops. Uh, so let's have a look here. So we've got. Um, Where's the where's the mag on? Oh, there she is. So I don't think she's actually got very, like, like thousands of achievements. Again, this uh, golden princess was actually given to me by one of you guys. Yeah. So one, two, three, four, five. So the foal has done better. So that's good. Well done, Charlie. You're producing awesome horses. So yeah, I'm super chuffed with these two. More the colouring than anything, because I'm a sucker for a strawberry roan as well. I just love all the horses. Yep. So there we go, guys. There's all of our studs. Pretty happy with those at the moment and then obviously we've got our mares here as well who I need to care for so um, most of these falls through here are Charlie's um, cupcake isn't Charlie's but cupcakes one of my favorites she's awesome so any videos that you guys want to see um, we have our Icelandics here and we have our knob Struppers foundation that's gonna take a while to do that one I think um, and I have some messages on here as well which I'll probably be reading the fan mail from um, but I do check them all through first in case I get any like offensive or crazy messages because believe it or not guys it does happen <laughs> I know um, I totally just bought this horse surely I'm gonna buy it again though <laughs> I'm just gonna buy them all I do like the Icelandics actually I think they're really cute they're really really cute the golden pianist I just wanted to buy that for its name uh, golden rebel let's check this one I shouldn't be buying any more horses guys guys Get me off this game. Okay, I'm not going to buy any more. No, it's not going to happen. <gasps> Let's just put this one in with its Icelandic buddies. And yeah, guys, comment below. What would you like to see more of? Do you want to see more horse reality, Equiverse, Horse World Online, Rival Stars? Of course. We're going to do a Planet Zoo series at some point, but I need to record my face. That's what I want to do as well. I want to record my face. That would be really, really cool. This one's super cute. Look how cute that is. It's like he's wearing a little hat or something. 
So let's just put this one in with these ones. Update. Hopefully we'll be getting some more cool Icelandic ponies. That's going to be wicked. Okay guys, I think that's it from us at Horse Reality today. What do you guys think? Comment in the box below. What do you want to see? Do you want to see more? We're going to do a horse quiz at some point as well. I need to do that. And guys, we are going to record some real life stuff, I promise. I just need to wait for the weather to get better. And then we'll be doing a day, like a 10k special, a, a day with my horses sort of things. So, but we need good weather for that over in it, here in England. We are in fact moving yards next Saturday, so it's going to be a bit crazy up to there. So hopefully I'll be able to film in the new yard when we've got school, the jump paddock and loads of other cool stuff. Okay guys, have a awesome day and I'll see you real soon. If you haven't subscribed, please do. If you could like or give us a carrot for the video, that would be wonderful. And if you want to join as well, we have a join button. That just means you guys can get really, really stuck in with the well becoming part of the lady ranger team i suppose so yeah it's all gonna be awesome thanks for watching guys have a awesome day and i'll see you real soon bye